Here we have this 68 plate BMW X3 xDrive 20D M Sport. It comes with 1200 pounds worth of factory extras, all of which are listed on the website. We've got the LED headlights with the black kidney grills in the center, fog lights either side of the number plate, front splitter at the bottom in black, front and rear parking sensors with a rear reversing camera with an in car visual display, 19 inch gloss black alloy wheels, all unmarked just there. We've also got the black side mirrors with the color coded door handles, privacy glass at the rear for the passengers with a black trim around the outside. We've got the black roof rails at the top with the colour coded shark fin antenna and the black spoiler just there. Onto the rear you'll be able to see we've got the quad tip exhaust integrated into the diffuser with the parking sensors running across the middle of the bumper. Now to open the tailgate we just press the tailgate button on the key and you can see that it automatically opens. Taking a look inside you can see that we've got plenty of room for whatever you may need just there and to close this tailgate we just press the button like so and it closes automatically. This car does come free from any major marks, dents or scratches. So as we take a look at the rear interior, you'll be able to see we've got the cream leather with the isofix points and the armrest in the center. We've also got the climate control for the passengers. We've got the ambient lighting that's running across the top of the door with the electric windows just there. Onto the front, we've got the same styling front seats, cream leather, and there is a look at those. Both of these seats are heated. We've got the electric windows with the electric side mirrors, child lock at the rear, and we've also got the ambient lighting running across the door as well. Automatic lights with the automatic wipers and the multifunctional steering wheel. Taking a seat inside, turning this vehicle on. My foot is on the brake, so we just press the start button like so, and you can see there is no warning lights on this dashboard other than the fuel. We've got the cruise control and speed limiter with the paddle shift behind and we've also got the volume button with the paddle shift behind on the right hand side. Onto the main screen you can see that we've got the satellite navigation, we've also got the DAB radio and the Bluetooth media, Bluetooth phone connectivity. If I just go into the settings, go across to my vehicle, vehicle settings and to lights, you can see that this vehicle also comes with the ambient lighting and you can change the colour also. It runs nicely across the dashboard and into the door. Going back to the main menu, popping this car into reverse and you'll be able to see we've got the rear reversing camera with the guidelines and the sensors on the left hand side. Popping it back into neutral, making it safe. We've also got the dual climate control with the air conditioning, heated seats on both sides with a heated rear window. We've also got the USB and the cup holders, automatic gearbox with the different drive modes. So as you press these buttons, it will come up on the screen, the different drive modes in which this vehicle can be driven. We've also got the dial and the function buttons for the screen with the electric parking brake. Now that's all I'm gonna show you guys today. For more information on this vehicle, you can head to the website or give our sales team a call. This car comes with a fresh MOT and a fresh service and free nationwide next day delivery. Thank you for watching. Video test drive of this BMW X3 xDrive 20D M Sport. Now the purpose of this video test drive is to show the vehicle drives as you expect it to. As you can see, I'm now to fight with the steering wheel to keep it in a straight line, but not moving off to the left or to the right hand side, but staying straight and true. Do have the multifunctional steering wheel, which has the paddle shifters on either side. If you wanted to set the car into manual mode, just tap one of the paddles and it would change gear. We do also have the speed limiter and the cruise control buttons on the left hand side, volume buttons on the right. We have the digital dashboard here in front of us which can show different displays that you would have seen on the photos and also the walk around video. And if you do listen carefully throughout this video test drive you'll also notice we'll be free from any unwanted knocks or bangs. And we do have the full leather interior throughout this vehicle which is very comfortable. You can use to do two or three or even 400 miles in this vehicle and still get out feeling fresh. Both the front seats are also heated, which is perfect for them cold winter mornings. And we do have the main infotainment screen here in the center, currently shown the sat nav. But again, we have plenty of other features on there that you would have seen on the photos. Below there, we have the free zone climb control with the r -Sport air conditioning, perfect for these hot summer days. And we also have the automatic gearbox with all the different drive modes as well. Now we're about to take a right hand turn in a moment, so I'll put the right indicator on and then make our way down to slow down to make the right hand turn. So we'll make the right hand turn now in a moment just onto the industrial park and then I'll be from an emergency stop now in three, two and one. Hard onto the brakes and then if you put the car into reverse, we have the reversing camera just there. Put it back into drive with no issues whatsoever. 
And if this video hasn't answered all your questions, please feel free to get in contact with our sales team where they can answer all unanswered questions along with running through some inquiries with you. But that's all for me today. Cheers.